we're about to demo how to add a comment, which is helpful for closing the loop and why closing the loop is valuable and important. Faculty often express concern that they don't know what happens after they raise a flag. Closing the loop demonstrates how various folks at the university are taking action to support students. First, open Starfish. Log in to Starfish using one of the following options. Navigate to starfish.uncg.edu or click on the Starfish icon from the iSpartan page. Use your UNCG username and password to sign in to the platform. Next, identify students. Click the hamburger icon to open your navigation menu. Click on students. Click the tracking tab. Select your row from the drop down menu or the All My Students option. Next, set your filters. Setting your filters is helpful for a bulk review for those with larger student caseloads. Click Edit Filters to see a list of flags since your last round of outreach. You can filter by status for active, resolved, or both, tracking type for flats, kudos, referrals. You can filter by item name for all academic flags. You can also filter by creation date. The date of your last outreach to today's date. This will populate a roster of all students with active flags based on the filters that you select. You can even review the most recent items for your students directly in Starfish or by clicking on the download button. This will open a CSV file or in Excel. Outreach to students using email communication should be personal, individualized, and brief. Pro tip, using YAM or Emma can help you structure outreach to multiple students more simply and efficiently. After you have completed your outreach and connected with a student, provide a closed the loop comment for the flag raiser. You can search for the student by student name or ID number by using the search box in the top right corner of your dashboard. Select the tracking tab within the student folder. Hover over the flag icon and click comment. In the subject box, be sure to include the student's first and last name course number and section, and the original flag raise. In the notes section, add any relevant information you wish to share with the original flag raiser. Next, check the box to send copy of comment to the flag raiser and click submit. In the student folder, there will be a plus symbol to expand where you can view the comment that you've just completed for the flag raiser. The flag raiser will also receive an email. Now you can successfully close the loop in Starfish. For Starfish support and assistance, Please always email the Starfish email account at starfish at uncg.edu. You can also visit the Students First webpage at studentsfirst.uncg.edu.